Wes Streeting. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Can I um, first of all offer my deepest thanks to first responders from the Metropolitan Police and the London Ambulance Service who uh, were greeted with the horrifying scene on Sunday night of an 18-month-old baby girl and three-year-old boy uh, brutally murdered in their own homes. There are no words of comfort that we can offer their grieving mother, but what the government can do is to do more to support people who are not safe in their own homes. I recognise the £3 million that has gone in to support children who witness domestic abuse and the £2 million that has gone in to support the domestic abuse hotline, but it is not enough and it is not quick enough. So, in that spirit, can I ask the First Secretary of State to commit to providing the £75 million ring fence fund that the Shadow Home Secretary has called for, so that in these darkest of times, for people who are trapped unsafe in their own homes, they know that support is available. First Secretary. Can I thank the Honourable Gentleman and first of all say uh, how appalled I am at the tragic case uh, in his constituency. I pay tribute um, to the frontline front line emergency responders, but I absolutely, in total solidarity with the Honourable Gentleman, uh, want to uh, pass my condolences to uh, the family around that uh, terrible case, and it sounds absolutely appalling. Uh, the police have been very clear that they will pursue perpetrators and anyone in immediate danger, and they should call 999. We are going through the coronavirus challenge. It has put pressure on the police, but they are there to do that incredible job that they do day in, day out. We do have the National Domestic Abuse Helpline staffed 24 hours a day. Um, we are supporting charities and uh, others supporting victims of domestic abuse with £750 million. Um, he makes some interesting points about what more we could do. Uh, we are constantly looking to reinforce and uh, strengthen the challenge of uh, the, the response to domestic abuse. And he is right that there is a specific issue around it in relation to this uh, crisis. The Domestic Abuse Bill had its second reading yesterday, um, and that will help uh, uh, take our response to the next level and also is an opportunity for him to make further proposals in due course.